Well, hello everyone. Thanks for joining me on today. Um, this video is for everybody that said the NC50 <laughs> was not my color. In the past, you guys know, I used the Pro Sponge uh, by MAC and my NC50. I read all my comments and people like, Atiyah, NW43, NW43. So, I took you guys' advice. Thank you so much. Um, today, uh, it is all about the NW43 Foundation Concealer and the famous Beauty Blender. So, in this video, of course, I went to Vegas. I went to Amp Salon and I bought the Beauty Blender along with the cleanser, a plus, for like $35 plus tax. Please see the video below if you do not have the Beauty Blender. It tells you how to clean it, how I apply it. Love it. So, um, the video today, again, is all about foundation and concealer. I want to give a shout out to Miss Devin Harvey. When I was at the MAC Houston, um, she just said for an even look, I used the NW40, uh, this tall studio sculpt concealer under the eye, just for a full even look. And I really like it. So if you want to go lighter under the eyes, of course, you can go to the NW35 uh, if you want to. It's totally up to you. But MAC Pro Sponge versus the Beauty Blender. Softer, has a cleanser. This is a little, I ain't gonna say tougher, but it's not as soft as the Beauty Blender. Plus, it doesn't have a cleanser. So, I'm a Beauty Blender girl. <laughs> so, I'm glad I got it. So, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Thank you, subscribers, for all your help. NW43 or NC50. I think I can use both. Check it out. Well, hello, everyone. Let me show you the Beauty Blender. It's pink, it's beautiful, it's soft, and here is the cleanser. In this video, I will show you only how to use the Beauty Blender. If you need to see the full video of the Beauty Blender, see the link below. I had a hard time trying to take this out, so. <laughs> Always take out from the bottom, not the top. And see how small it is? Straight from the south. It's With very soft. North, and I can teach you how to flood. I ain't so next, no let's apply water. Tick, tick. Just to teach you fly. Winging it sometimes, but hey, the sister tries. What you need to know about who you know what he has got it all can get it. In this part, you will see once I apply water. It grows. <laughs> it expands. So if you could look at the previous from here, you'll see that it definitely has gotten bigger. Just take out the excess water with the cloth. Now this step is up to you. I'm going to apply concealer for a full even look. I'm using the NW40 from the Studio Sculpt Concealer with MAC 256. Again, you can use your fingers. It's all up to you how you want to put on your concealer. A lot of people warm it up um, on their um, palm of their hands. It's totally up to you. And I always go backwards. Once I went forward, it kind of gave me this. Yeah, I always go backwards. It's just when I went forward, it gave me a funny feeling on my eyes. So, I don't know why I kept going from it. So. And right here, I'm just going to use the Beauty Blender just to soften it out. Nice, even And if you want to make it lighter, use NW4035 if you're my color. And on this part, I'm sure you did both of the eyes already. So I did both sides. Now let's use the NW43. Let's apply the makeup. On here, I just used one of my Cinema Secrets uh, makeup pants. And again, I'm using a Studio Fix Fluid, NW43, with my Sigma Brush SS190. Just want to kind of warm up the makeup in my hand. So up to you. Now on this part, you will see me use the um, Beauty Blender three different ways. I will apply my makeup on first, then use it. And at the end of the video, you will see me only apply the makeup onto the Beauty Blender. And you will see at the end which one I prefer better. So right here, I'm just like stempling, I guess you can say. Stemple the makeup. I hope that's the right word. So it's told up to you again how you want to apply. 
before you use your voodoo blender. Again, there's so many people that has their videos out on beauty blender, so check them out. So now I'm just going to apply the beauty blender to the makeup, just for a nice, flawless finish. Honestly, I do think I can use both makeups. So here's the other side with makeup and the other side without. <laughs> so let's just finish the rest of the, the face. I was about to say the hair. <laughs> so used to that. So. so right here I'm still using the brush. Once again, just apply your beauty blender, roll it simple, however you feel comfortable using the beauty blender. And if you have used the beauty blender, please let me know how you enjoyed it. So right here, I'm going to just take the makeup and put it on the beauty blender and around my nose and on my forehead and my eyes. And when I do that, I honestly feel like it's just so much better to do it that way. But again, it's totally up to you if you want to do your brush first, then use the beauty blender. Take your choice. I see when um, Kim Kardashian, um, her makeup style is Mario. He does it with makeup on the beauty blender. So again, it's however you feel comfortable. And this camera is so in and out of focus. I do apologize for the blurry of the video. I will try to go back to Best Buy and see how to get that fixed. So again, thanks for being patient about that. Triple should get you looking right, ladies. And I am the one and only Ricky Little Rockwell. Yeah. And I'm gone, gone. Yeah, I just like it so much better. So next time, I would just definitely do the makeup on the Beauty Blender. So what do you guys think? I just had to put it back on my face. It's so soft. <laughs> I really like it. So, again, this is the NW43. So, let's finish up the face. I'm going to just add some of my um, just superb gloss. It's old. I haven't used it in a while. It's my MAC. Nice finish to the lips. And instead of me using dark as I would with the NC50, I'm using medium deep. That's what I was told. Because if I had to use dark, it would have just made the, the makeup darker. So I didn't want to do that with my SS150 by Sigma. So this is the ending of this look. Let me know if NW43 is my color. I thank you guys for all your help. You have a wonderful day. And there's a birthday bash video coming up next. Mwah.